Welcome to week four of the Return to Dance Tennis Workout. This is the hard session or the hard video, the video for the hard session. Um, so this, hopefully you've done the warm up as well. So this could be the warm up from the actual warm up video or just taking a warm up from the live session as well. So hopefully you're already warmed up to join me for this week's hard session. Okay, so this week's hard session, I'm going to add in an extra exercise for the core workout, an extra exercise for the plyometrics as well. I'll, do the, I'll show you the plyometric one when we do the plyometrics, but the new exercise for the core session is a one-legged V-sit. So we have a two-legged V-sit, the, the normal V-sit looks like this, the one-legged V-sit is one arm, Alternate legs, move up, then alternating as well. So if we're looking face on, it should look like this. And that's the new exercise as well. So we are going to have 16 exercises for the core workout and then 13 for, for plyometrics. Okay, so the, the session is going as squats, lunges, the ceiling touches. So I'll just go through them anyway. Okay, squats, okay, lunges, okay. Ceiling touches, calf raises, then you've got the elbow to knee crunch on the floor. Okay, then you've got the leg raise, elbow to knee crunch on the floor. Then you've got the leg raises, the flutter kicks, the V6, the new exercise is the one leg V6. Okay, then you've got the ankle taps, which is the exercise we joined, we introduced last week. So, ankles move, touching your ankles. Okay, then you've got the Russian twist, legs up from the air, touching each side of your body. Okay, then you've got the B plank, which is something we did do in the live session, but something we introduced in week one. I think it was, yeah, or we one of the pre recorded B plank, which we're lifting up the legs, holding it. Okay, then you've got the press ups. Okay, you can do a modified version, knees on the floor, they can be going down, or knees off the floor and going down. So the press ups. Then you have the plank. I'll demonstrate the plank like this. Okay, however, you can do the plank like that as well. Then you have the shoulder taps. You're touching your shoulders. Then everyone's ready to finish. Tricep dips. With the tricep dips, you can keep your legs bent, or your knees bent, sorry. You can then go down. I'm going to demonstrate my legs straight and go down as well. Okay, so there are the 16 exercises for the core. Okay, so we're going to do 20 seconds exercise, 10 seconds rest. So I won't have much time to talk to you next. I will just have to say what the next exercise is and then hope that you're in the correct position to do it. Okay, so I'm just going to grab some water as well. Like you should in case you're getting too hot. There will be two minutes rest in between the core session and the plyometric session, just for me to show you what the exercises are. So you get a rest, unfortunately I don't, but that's how it is. So you've got 16 exercises, 20 seconds work, 10 seconds rest. We're gonna start by doing squats. So we're gonna start getting in the squat positions, Five, four, three, two, one, and go squats. And stop there. Ten seconds rest to get into the lunges. Should be standing up and ready. Lunge in three, two, one, and go.
10 seconds. And stop there. The next one, ceiling touches going up. Then John touch your toes as well. So in three, two, one, and go. Ten seconds. And stop there. Next one is the calf raises. Again, calf raises up, off the ground, and then back down. Let's go. 20 seconds. Ten seconds left. And stop there. Next one is the elbow to the punches. I'm going to do the floor. So you bring turn to the elbow to the knee to the middle. And go. Ten seconds. And stop there. Okay, the next one is the leg raises. So stay down on that mat for the leg raises. Starts in three, two, one, and go. Don't forget to three with the leg raises as well. Ten seconds. And stop there. Okay, try and get your breath in, try and cover quickly. Five seconds until we do the flutter kicks. Okay, three, two, one, and go. Last five. And stop there. Okay, the next one, everyone's favourite, is the B6. Okay, starts in five, four, three, two, one, and go. Don't forget to breathe as you're doing the exercises. Last five. And stop there. Okay, 10 seconds rest until we do the one leg B set. So again, one arm, one leg. Okay, the B set ready and go. Make sure your shoulders come off the floor. Touch your leg. And stop there. Ooh. Next one is the ankle taps. Okay, one we added a few weeks back. Ankles, stop touching. Let's go. Ten seconds. And stop. Okay, the next one is the Russian twists. Feet off of the floor. Okay, touch the side of your hips. Ready? And go, rotate them. Let's go. Ten seconds. Five. And stop there. Okay, the next one is the B plank. So making sure your feet come off the floor, creating that V shape as well. Three, two, one, and go.
10 seconds. And stop. Okay, next one. Turn the body around. Get ready for the press ups again. You're doing your knees or off your knees. For the press up three, two, one, and go. Ten seconds. And stop. Okay, the next one is the plank. Bring on the elbows. In three, two, one, and go. Don't forget to breathe, don't hold it within. Ten seconds. And stop. The next one is your shoulder taps. I'm only going to go up my, onto my arms, straight arms. Three, two, one. Let knees off the floor, top. Start touching your shoulders. Ten seconds. And stop there. Last exercise. Okay, so tricep dips. Move your legs straight. You can do it legs bent. Ready and go. And stop there. Okay, so that is all for the core session. We've got two minutes, two minutes rest. Okay, while I go through all the plyometrics. Okay, the plyometrics, first exercise, the mountain climbers. Basically, is the straight arm plank. Making your legs go as quick as possible to your elbows. Okay, the next one, jump and squat. One after that, jump and lunge. Can't do any jumping squats or jumping lunges. Either do a squat, do a normal squat or normal lunge. Jump and lunge. Doing that. Next one after that is the plain caper. One after that is the fast hops left leg. And then fast hops right leg. Then it's going to be a mile step. You can either do a, a run step, a double step. Okay. Another style of double step, which is a lot more or less, less height. And then you've got the single step as well. So now I'll turn up to you. I'll probably be demonstrating the advanced step there and then later on the higher up, the more lifted double step. Okay, then with the more steps, then you've got the in and out squats. You go in, go out, go in, back in and down. Next one is the four jumps. Basically, jump in, one to turn, jump, one to turn. One off of that is a plyo jack. Can't do a plyo jack, just do a jumping jack. Jumping jack's that. Okay, a plyo jack is this. Okay, after that is a split lunge. Can't do a split lunge, just do a jumping lunge. Okay, split lunge. Go, go down, up, turn, up. Okay, one after that is a burpee. So with the burpee, you go down, and jump. So you're basically doing a press up, bring your legs back up. So basically doing a press up, down, up, bring your legs up. And you're going to jump up as well. You're going to make it even harder for yourself. As you jump in, 
to apply Jack as well. Okay, then we go to the mind steps. So I think that is slightly more than two minutes rest. I'm just going to grab some water. And we're going to go straight into the plyometrics. Okay, so we've got 20 seconds exercise, 20 seconds rest, 13 exercises. I know it's unlucky for some, but hopefully it won't be for you guys. So that's 20 seconds work, 20 seconds rest, 13 exercises. Ready to get the mountain climbers in five seconds. Let's go. Mountain climbers. And go. Ten seconds. And stop. Thirty seconds rest. So then go into the jumping squats. So you're going to go down, then add the jump shot after a squat. Ten seconds. Five, three, two. Well, jump the squats, let's go. Ten seconds. And stop there. Twenty seconds rest. Then go into the jumping lunges. 10 seconds. Three, two, one, jump and lunges, let's go. And stop there. Next one is the plank capers. Okay, continuous plank capers, 20 seconds, 10 seconds to go. Five seconds. Plank capers, let's go. And stop there. Okay, next one is the fast hops on your left leg. Five seconds. Fast hops, left leg, ready, and go. Ten seconds. And stop there. Should now be feeling your left leg clamping up and tensing up like crazy. That should subside as we're waiting to do the exact same onto your right side as well. Five seconds. One hops. And go. And stop there. Okay, so now for you and your right leg, coming up a lot. Okay, next thing we're going to do is the double steps. I'm going to be doing the one step. You can do whatever step you want, it's entirely up to you. Okay, three seconds. More steps, let's go.
and stop. Okay, now we've got some water quickly. Next one is the in and out squats, 10 seconds. Three, two, one, and go in and out. Let's go. Ten seconds. And stop there. Okay, the next one is the broad jumps. Jump in. Then the quick plate to turn. And then repeat. Make sure you're not always turning the same way. Okay, the broad jumps. Five seconds. Three, two. One, and go. And stop there. Okay, the next one is the flyer jacks. Try and get as much air as you can to your lungs. Ready for the plyer jacks. In five seconds. Ready, plyer jacks, let's go. Do jumping jacks, you can't do a plyer jack. And stop there. Next one is the split lunges. Punch and split lunges. Just do a jumping lunge. Five seconds. And go. Ready for the burpees. So one, just go down, in, and up. Don't do it for a Five seconds. Ready, steady, burpees. Let's go. Stop there. Go some if you can. The last exercise left. That is the mower steps. You pick what you want. I'm going to do the higher floaty double step. Three, two, one, and go. And stop there. Okay, so that is the end of the fourth session, fourth hard session of the return to dance fitness workout. If you can, if you want to, you can just replay the session. Don't forget to do the cool down afterwards because if you're not, you may, may feel achy or sore the next day. So make sure you do the cool, work, cool down workout as well. Hope you enjoyed the session and see you next week.